Today we're going to talk about the art of startup hiring and firing. There's a startup mantra in the community that says you got to hire people slowly and fire them quickly. And uh, I'm not so sure that's the best approach if you're trying to increase the speed of your startup. I can tell you based on my experiences as a venture capitalist and uh, entrepreneur is that my mantra is to hire them quickly and fire them even quicker if they're not a cut out to, to do whatever they have to do for your startup. I'll give you a perfect example. I hired a guy once and this guy told me he could sell ice cream to an Eskimo and he talked a really good game. But when he was put into a situation to sell and you know if you're doing a startup you gotta find the people that are gonna sell not do business development from a perspective of not creating any sales and don't get me wrong I love business development because I've done it myself as well but you have to be able to produce so if the person is not producing because you're a startup you have the luxury to fire him really quickly and that was one of my mistakes I liked the guy a lot he was a jovial guy he was a great guy you know he was really friendly and everybody loved him but he just could not produce and finally I fired him but it took me too long to do it and when you're doing a startup even if you're well funded you don't have that luxury and it takes a lot of courage to do that so think about it if you take too long trying to figure out who you want to hire but then you hire him and then they don't work out then you wasted a lot of time going through the process of hiring people so I still think uh, in an unorthodox way is that it's better to hire him quickly and then put them into the environment let it check them out let it, let's see what they do in the conditions that are set up for them to perform and if they don't perform you've got to be able to fire them and that's easier said than done I speak from experience <laughs>